fire and brimstone and driving knees in the midfield. Got BC. Oh, he's through, he's away. He's got Varney in the banana yellow boots on the inside. And no one will catch him now. Oh, lovely break coming through from Duquan. Gets it away now. Opportunity for Bordeaux Begler. And they're flying winger Tambui. Nice Billy Twelve Trees misses the tackle first up. And then it's all about Duquan. But what a tackle that is from Stephen Varney, as you say. It looked like a forward pass. Mori carries it forward. Varney again sees the gap. Absolutely incredible start from it from Italy. Gabrisi straight across there. Ioanni not stopping him from there. England at sixes and sevens. Very little opportunity to properly stretch his legs. Carreras again. Tying in those defenders. Lovely from Sassino. Varney's away. Varney will score. They peel back to the right-hand side, and Lorenzo Canone is going to celebrate his debut. Big win for the Azzurri. Martu Leatawa on Nifi Leatinganga, also into the Samoan. His route to the ball was blocked off. Varney, did he just manage to keep that in his fingertips? He did, and the scrum half is away now. And up to the five-metre line is the quick pick from Varney. It's the score for Italy! The nature of the town, there's a big gap opening up. It's, here. it's a simple run in for Varney. Bai tries to strip the ball, but he can't. Varney, little show, little show again. And the third time it goes to Ioanni. And Ioanni's away, and he's got pace. And Monte Ioanni out of nothing. Still rolling forwards, Johnny made Varney. Whips it away to 12 trees, brilliantly taken in by Jordy Reed. Fires his way into Homer over the top. Was that forwards? Varney scores. As we approach half time, that was good from Canone. The second row, round comes Varney. They're trying, he's looping round. Bansic, oh, Donald is and loses it. There's a chance for Stevenson. Held up two metres out. Well. And here goes Kapawatsa with the ball away. And Varney was up in support. Cipriani, that defence up so fast, but Harris realised that. Now he's got Varney inside. Varney in support, will go over for Gloucester's third try. Number nine. He's so good at that, isn't he? Damn it, outside him. Here we go, inside there, that was from Atkinson. And look at this stunning stuff from Gloucester. And he's just got there. From a, a driving line out, France don't hang around with it long. Dante, Fiku, chasing hard. Ball needs to be claimed and is by Varney. He was under an awful lot of pressure. Back pedaling. Look at that kick. Well. Dino Lamb, the next man forward. And now Varney just rolls a little kick in behind. Well, Jordan, and it's not going to be a 50-22. It was taken back, but it's still an excellent kick nonetheless. Foster need to be careful not to be turned over. Clement shifted again. Trinder this time. Atkinson, bit of room. Back inside. Lovely line of running from Trinder. Trinder finds Varney. Varney will score. Varney hoisted high. Test for Jamine. And it's picked up, and Italy driving forward with loose ball, and Varney sets them off, and here's Halafiti. Use it! Varney. A good height in that, and that was a beautifully placed kick, and what a thump that is coming in from Thorley. And the ball there being gathered by the Italians, Carlo Canna, tremendous work from him. And here's Maxi Mumbanda. Well, they're playing here with great ambition. And Varney's away, and this man could really can sprint, testing out Johan Lloyd. Yeah, well, England made, well, Italy made 957 metres against France, eight line breaks, passed the ball 100 more times than France, kept the ball in hand 93% of the time. Careering through a oh, hole. Tiny advantage, high tackle. Jordy Reid with the delay ball, Freddie Clark. Barney. It was Dupont, and here's Penno. It suddenly opened up for him. Little chip over the top, all about the bounce, and uh, Varney is shot. Varney, take to the skies with this one. 
This one on Ben Stevenson, he's backpedaling again and can't get to it and it's loose. And there's the try, the follow-up and the chase from Jake Morris. Looking for opportunity on the opposite the flank. Over. Varney gets his kick away. In. Well, Stephen Varney has had an immaculate game in. at BPL scrum half. Up. He really has. 50-22, kicks the ball away from the turnover. But a perfect bounce there. The match is on, Gloucester in control, Pelletri reels away, it'll be Barney to score. So cool, just looking over the top to see what was around, tried to thread it through for Villiers, and in the end it was read by Stephen Varney, threat extinguished. It is indeed in Salem now, back up to seven players. Oh, they've done really well. Hard work of Josh Gray to get highest and then the charge through and it is a spectacular finish. And Stephen Varney has snatched it for Gloucester.